Sure you got it good enough. On the show, on the chat thing and YouTube's channel. folks uh just out here tooling around on the cushman just got back a little bit ago from uh ohio cat in perrysburg ohio because i needed to pick up some parts for the frankenstein truck and uh couldn't get this hose anywhere so finally got this hose that i need from uh them I called a dealership yesterday and they said hey they got it so I got two chunks right here, and I got um, some fittings just in case, just in case I need them, which I hope I don't, because I'm going to use the other ones, but I told the dude, he's like, I got two fittings, but I don't have all four. I said, that's all right. I still got the other ones. I'll um, see if I can make them work, and I just wanted to have two just in case, because that one was kind of stripping out a little bit, but uh, we'll cruise over to uh, the garage where we're going to be performing some work and then uh we'll cruise back over to uh well actually we'll probably walk because that's the distance right there from uh the garage to where it is you know because I, I wanted to see what they would charge for uh the rebuild and stuff for the chalk and i took him in a picture and the dude was like holy shit I've never seen anything like that. I'm like, yeah, that's what the truck is, blah, 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 this and that. And I talked to one guy in there. He was um for a company. And I said, you ever seen this? He's like, yeah, I live over in Bowling Green. I've seen it. I said, you've probably seen the blue truck, too. And he's like, yeah, I've seen that one, too. So that's cool, man. That is cool, man. So let's um get you out of here real quick. And we'll go over because we got oil pan. We'll prob we, we probably don't need. We're probably not going to get dirty, which is nice. We're not going to get dirty. But um, get you open, and I don't know if I got freaking. No, I don't. I don't have the screwdriver in the door. Booby trap and shit. No mean. Yeah, pull out those other hoses right there, and uh, swap those fittings out. I've got one hanging out somewhere right up there. So that's the one that is um, got the boo boo on him. So we'll uh. We'll see if we can get these swapped out real quick. We're gonna get this done. There's some hoses right there. I can get some gloves first and we'll mess up the shit. Hope we get one of these other ones off real quick here. And um, I'll take the one off that's bad, obviously, because I got the one hose that's bad. Blow it out right there. And then it just crank off. No problem. Figure out which one. Inch in. That's three quarters. Yeah, come on, baby. Okay. 
Okay, just twist that off by hand now. That'd be nice. And you know that one, well, that's the one that's blowed out, of course. The one that's blowed out. Well, oh yeah, that's a lot better than what I did to that one. Oh, I scooped that one, but bad. Bad. If I can get this thing off. Just like that, man. Just like that. I don't know why this thing ain't going down like it's supposed to. Maybe I just ain't strong enough. I don't get on there. Get on there and get on there straight. Come on. Yeah, it's going. Okay. Hell. Some bitch don't want to go so freaking far. Get on there. I don't only go. Maybe it only goes so far. I don't know. We don't. We don't want that thing. On. We want it all the way down. We want it all the way down there. Okay, oh, we got her. Oh yeah, that's good. That is good. Oh yeah, just like that, that's what I'm talking about. I think, yeah. Well, that's what's up. Never done this before. Oh, probably have to start cranking it over now. I can only go so far by hand. Oh yeah, just hold her right there like that. Crank her down. Crank her down, baby. Well, I don't think that's going anywhere. I can... Oh, come on, stay on there. One more, just a little bit more here. Just a little bit more. Good enough, I'd say. I'd say that's good enough. Cause ain't, ain't going no more. Now, the question is, is can I use this old one? And do the same thing with it. And get it on there. The one that's semi stripped. Oh, see, it's gonna. That'll. I think so. I mean. That's what we got going on here. This guy is still good on the inside of here. This guy is kinda. You can see that obviously. It's kinda worn down. I mean, I can get it to turn and it'll stay in that pocket. So can I uh, crank it down enough? Uh, get that grill, that inner grill out, and see if I can do it. I don't know. I don't know. We gotta get this thing on first. If not, we got two brand new ones. We got two brand new ones over. We are doing. I'm gonna have to crank this one on the whole freaking time. I guarantee that. I'm gonna try another go my work email, man. That damn work email. It's loads.
All right, with the tip. We are at the tip. Oh, yeah, no, this is what I'm worried about here. This guy ain't just gonna freaking turn on. I don't, I doubt it. I really doubt it. That's it, I'm going to the vise. I'll be back. Actually, I'll take you with me. Let's see if we can stick this in there and see what happens. Look to the mess. Get you out the way. Get you out the way. You know, there, a bunch of cans and stuff. We were slobbing that up over here. Okay, I think it's, I'm almost positive. I'm gonna go get that wrench. Okay, so maybe it's not. Oh, it's still, still not. May have to just get the other one out. See what the is going on. No, well, it's still not. Jesus Christ, come on. Fuck this. We're gonna switch it up. I'm not using that fucker. I'll be back. I don't know. We'll see. We'll get them. We'll get them off camera because this is the kind of guy we are. And we'll put them on. Because this uh, this ain't working and I'm done pissing with it because I'm done with it. Well, I got them both on. And that was hard. Um, Every single one of them, except that one that I was struggling with, turned right on until the end where I had to wrench him down a little bit. They're um they're under the wagon right now, sitting over there on a piece of fucking cardboard because um I've got to get ready to go to work because I got work and then tomorrow the next couple days I'm gonna take off because I got things to do around here since the weather's super nice. Finally not raining, not 40 degrees, um garden, lawn, work on a green truck some more. coconut water with pieces it's really good um you know just do stuff like that around the house spring cleaning a little bit we went in torn to the um smokehouse yesterday and that was a freaking mess nuts all over from the squirrels probably pissed them off because i cleaned their house out and stuff but um it's what it is had to do it sorry boys you're moving out we're kicking you out so we'll see tomorrow we'll be back we gotta go run the blue truck Oh, whoops. Oh, man, look at that shit, folks. See that cone right there? This fucking bonehead right here, Bonehead Truckers Edition. Welcome back to the Chad Keegan YouTube channel. Bonehead Truckers Edition. This dude over here pulls in, uh, is in lane two, then decides to go round somebody into lane three, turns his truck off, it blocks both lanes, and uh, apparently it's got bad batteries with my hair. Oh, look at that. Look at that shit, man. Look at that. Curly cute boy. Anyways, this guy's got freaking dead batteries and a bad clutch. You can't start his truck, so he's now blocking two lanes. So everybody's dwindling down to the express lane. 
Uh, I guarantee they're probably not happy about that inside. And I'm going to bitch when I get in there because this freaking bullshit. And I might be able to slide through their bobtailing um, and get by to lane two. I don't know. I'm going to wait till I get up here a little bit farther. Once this guy uh, in front of me moves up, I'm going to try and slide through there so I can uh, go into lane two. But the trailer checker comes out and says, hey, can you pull this guy? I said, no. I don't have straps in this truck, and I'm not doing it in this truck. If I was in Frankenstein, I'd, I'd and I had a strap or a chain or somebody did around here, I'd hook up to that dude, and I'd drag him regardless whether his air brakes were on or not. Because uh, that thing, the 433 rear ends will pull anything around this truck. Not doing it with the 433s. Or uh, 373 rear ends, not, just not happening. So... Yo, Big Mike definitely man running a damn Sonnenberger truck, man. The truck broke down, man. But, uh, yeah, on Wednesday, hump day. Irritating, man. People are freaking dumb. Let's get, once I get up here, we'll get your eyes on them a little bit more. Oh, yeah, shit, yeah. Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, there's plenty of room I can fit through there. Look at this guy right here blocking both fucking lanes. Look at me. Look at me go. Yeah, look at all this space up here. Dumb mother. So I just went in and talked to uh, Adam. And I said, how long has he been there? He says, about a half hour. Uh, out in the yard right now, getting ready to hook up. He said, just acting nonchalant like ain't no big deal. And I'm like, yeah, dude, it's kind of a big deal. This trailer looks like it's low. I may have to get out and um, crank it up. I hope not. I hope this thing, as long as I can get under it with the um, ramps, Nope, I'm gonna have to get out and crank this thing up. Son of a bitch, I must have seen one of the yard guys. Ah! Never mind, I, I flipped on the diff lock and I gave it a little bump. We're under, but um, we are uh, Okay, now we just, woo! We just got to the fifth wheel, so we're gonna have to get some ass. Differential lock coming through. That's what I'm talking about. Well, this guy's about fucking retarded too. Let's get your eyes over here. Look at this guy. Get out of here. Look at this guy over here. See him? Now keep going cranking. You got it. Jackknife in it. Is everybody dumb out here? I don't understand what's going on. Temp solution. I bet he's coming from up north, if you know what I mean. Man, I just, I just don't understand. There's a uh, old international cab over, kind of like the one I showed you the other day when I stopped and went through, sitting over in a Vulcan waiting. But um, I, there's too many trucks for me to go do them, and I've already waited in line, so I gotta get moving. Goes wild man van scooter on his hog cruising through the ramp. I don't know what the fuck he's doing, but that's hilarious.
your eyes on something real quick if we can still see it. It's uh, getting dark, but um, look at that coal up here. Uh, you probably can't see it very well. Let me spin you around and uh, I'll get you a zoom on that stack, man. We got some coal up there. We've been rolling some coal in this damn freaking truck. Look at that tip. We're on call on that tip. You know what time it is. The blue light's on, don't you? got those lines over there under the wagon so let's get this thing jacked up so we can get them back on because uh we need to get it jacked up so we can get back on we find a good spot for you right there's probably good right there is probably good get that out of way. and uh we need to get this thing cleaned because it's been sitting for too long with this oil and shit on there but we gotta get this on there
scope onto there. Oh, we got a couple more cranks. You gotta crank her up, mine. A couple more times. Got it. Good enough. Good enough. Okay. Okay, so what we got going on here, we got to get them lines put back on here. Boom, boom. I just threw some towel up under there because I hadn't, um, you know, had the stuff. And I covered it with this, but the wind blew it off. Uh, it rained. I didn't want any water or anything getting up in there, so I just figured throwing them towels would be up there still dry, so they're okay. But um, I guess the only problem is, is... I don't quite remember which uh, which one goes where. I'm gonna put them on anyways because I think I might know. And then we'll fire up the truck and we'll see what happens with all the pressure. And um, if not, it's just one swap. So it ain't gonna be too big of a deal. And if we throw a little oil, I mean, what's it matter? We're probably low anyways, we need to check that. So let's go get those lines and get them taken care of. So I guess the thing of it is, is which, we gotta get down up under here. Now James Pretty and me are talking right now. He's up in Alaska. Uh, then he's gotta go to New York and he's gotta come somewhere else. I asked him how the weather is. It's nice, sunny, and cold out. I'm gonna tell him it's 85 here. He and a scorcher. But I got to figure out which, um, I'm, I'm almost positive. Let's get you over here real quick. Oh, I'm moving some shit. Get out of there. I'm dragging that around in the fucking dirt like a moron. This guy right here, I'm pretty sure he goes up under there. And then this guy just goes to there like at, up at the top. So we'll see. I got to get a towel real quick because I am a freaking idiot. I just drug this through some damn... Oh. Freaking good God, Bobby. I'll turn you on mute. Yeah. Now, let's get these all cleaned up here real quick. You know, I, I need to take these over and blow them out probably before I do anything. So, I'll be back. But at least we're getting this all tipped, all cleaned up. So well, I blow them out. Um, I blow them out. Um, I blow them out. So let me get Big Chachi lined up over here because I gotta climb up under here and uh, try to get to this. I got nothing protecting me down here on the stone. Get some of this down here real quick so we ain't laying off on the ground we're gonna get the chad keegan youtube channel shirt completely dirty probably that's all right because we can wash it and uh let's pull this bad boy out of here get a little towel up there because that's what you do it's the kind of guy we are oh man she covered down here they don't remember which ones i took out hey unfortunately you can't see what i'm doing up here and uh you're too far away right now oh yeah it just collapses it's it's fantastic i have to let guy right there like that and we'll just stick one of these guys up here and see, see if he'll go get out of there get out of there Okay, we got to, um, you know, we got to unscrew this other guy right here. Luckily, it'll, that hose right in your face, ain't it? Let's see how dirty we, we try not to get dirty here. We're just covered, in, everything's covered in oil under here. And I'll get your eyes on it in a minute. It's just gross. It's just freaking gross, folks. 
Oh, get. Get out of there. Get out of there. Okay. I'll get under there. Okay. All right. Well, that's fantastic. That's exactly the one that needs to be under there. So. like that. I don't know if it needs to be being tighter or not. It just don't seem like it's very tight. Yeah, let's put the that one up first. You can't see any any of this stuff but it's uh it's kind of complicated. jam too far in there we got to just stop what we're doing okay get up there right there I think I get him centered up and I'm gonna I'm probably gonna have to shower after this there's no way around not getting fucking completely covered here there's just no way around it. my face itches and I probably got shit falling on me and you know what? I'm gonna do a horse bath. I'll do me give me a self a horse bath over in the um over in the old wash tank over in the pit. Give me a horse bath in the pit. That's what I'm gonna do. You know, I, I, I probably should have done the one in the back first. That seems like the smartest thing to do, which I didn't do. Because, well, I've been an idiot today. I've made some idiot mistakes today. Not a couple of idiot things. So, it's what it is, though. Because I'm a creep. I'm a widow. Let's see if we can get this bad boy to go on. Oh. You're around there, mister. Sucks doing shit by yourself. I'm telling you. You got buddy to help you out? Nope. Oh, don't got nobody. I, I, I ain't got nobody. Nobody. Of course, you got to take... Two bolts out to be able to get the thing to go in there. Oh yeah, 409. She's real fine, my 409. Hopefully you can't hear that. Uh, it's not resonating too much from the garage because I do got the radio on in there. But, uh, whatever. Oh, yeah, you can see my hand up there, can't you? Right between that old spring and stuff, mine. 409, 409. I guess if I had help, it wouldn't, it wouldn't quite be as fun, would it, if I had help? Because then somebody else would be in the way, in the video, all up in my space. Because all I got to do is bam with Big Chachi up under here and... um. Nope, I gotta take that thing completely off before I can get that to go up there. Then I gotta sit there and try to hold that thing up there. And uh put that bolt in. Oh you gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I got him. Definitely wasn't going in with uh won't be out there, but it's up there. Now I can start working this other one in there. Yeah. Big chachi gonna get dirty. 
get out, get out of there, get out of there, boy. Get your ass up. You fucking kidding me, you son of a bitch. No, it feels tight. I'll come back down with a actual wrench and doing. Cause he he moved. Oh great! I got the things in there so tight I can't even move them around if I need to. But uh, figure it out once we get up here. I can always loosen them up and do it if I need to. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Get you out of here. Town to grab you because uh, we're super dirty, and it's what we're dealing with right here. See, we got to uh, pull a couple of them off. I should be able to just, yeah, just do this right, right here, like this by hand. And this is exactly what I was doing down there. See, those just collapse and break apart, but um, you've got to at least have, I think that many off for it to be able to go in it we'll do this one in the back first and i gotta figure out which one goes to which because you, you know it doesn't say anywhere on anything in and out so the one that had rubbed the hole was the one in the back because the one in the front is the one i took it off so the one in the back Pretty sure it came from the front. Let's get this other one up here real quick. Anything that's on him, get out of there. Get that shit out of there, man. Okay, he's completely off here. Well, nothing can just be simple, can it? Everything's got to be fucking complicated, don't it? I'm talking everything. I'm pretty sure that's how they go. I guess we'll find out in uh, about 15 minutes. We go to fire it up. A. and spin it this way to get it out the way. No, not, not quite enough. Okay, there we go. Alrighty. You know, my hands are way too dirty to even stop you, so that's what it is. I don't, uh, I don't really know where to set you either because you're just going to be like oblonged and weird because you're just kind of hanging out. You know? 
can't see shit from there. Yeah, I guess whatever. I'm just taking this stuff right here like this. I can't even see it. These all tightened down and nice and tight. Not over tight because, well, we're probably going to have to um, come back here and do some stuff. Because uh, I don't, I don't know, man. I just don't know. I mean, it was a guesstimate. And uh, there's really no, there's nothing that says in nor out. So, I don't know. Oh, that's a stupid, there's one bolt that's smaller than the rest. I forgot about it. It's a 5.8. It's a 5.8. So, it's the same size for the thread, but the, uh, the bolt head is smaller. I completely forgot about that guy. It's way out. Crank this one down by hand before we start cranking her. Because we don't need to sit here and do this. Man, this thing is so gross. What time it is, I probably could have worked today. But uh, with all the stuff that I've been doing, I probably could have ran some loads. I thought that's all right that we're not because uh, we um we got just we got the mow still yeah, that's probably good I don't see anything going wrong with that let the zip tie these down or something once I get them figured out not going nowhere not going nowhere so I guess now let's let me go clean my hands and um We'll jump up in there and fire it up and get down and check out the situation. And I uh, hope that ain't, we ain't got no problems. But we'll check the oil first because we definitely need to do that. Let's pull this dipstick real quick and check this oil here, man. Because uh, we need to. We got a bunch of dirty. Oh, that rag's nasty. It's all over the tire. But I guess it really don't matter because everything's gross. Everything is freaking gross around here. You know what I mean? So it's what it is out of here I, I guarantee we're low oh look at that still says we're still says we're above full if you can believe that because uh where are you at let's get your eyes on that right there you probably can't see that very well because it's dark first of all but right there where you at right there yeah you can't tell it says full it says full right here Okay, and it's above it. So let's wipe it off real quick. There you go. Add full, blah, blah, blah. This thing's so weird. It, uh, it'll sling and spit oil for, I don't know, a month straight, and I'll check the oil, and it'll still be above full. It'll be full, and uh, I won't ever have to add any yeah, still at full. So whatever we lost or slung, I had no issues with this truck. That's why it was running so good the last time. I said, hey, this thing's running really good though. So let's, um, I guess we'll just jump in. We'll leave it sitting like this and fired up because we'll want to come and check our work and make sure we ain't slinging nothing. You know what I mean? Then maybe we'll um, later on go over it. And uh, wind's starting to pick up mine. Just fine. I'll probably end up getting on the mower. I don't know if I'll wash this thing today. I might wait until first thing in the morning to do it. But um, let's get up in here and see if she'll fire. Oh shit, the key. Man, the key ain't even in a damn McDash on. Look at that shit. There it is. Get that key, man. Yeah, it's this one right here because the other ones are for the door locks. Remember when I put replaced the door locks on here? like that it's alive let's get back out a little pressure oh, boom shot off the 65 it usually does when it first starts so let's get out and um let's get out and check i i don't know man i mean oh 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 we got leak oh 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 shit we got them all back we got the uh 
big old mess on the damn ground, man. And let's see, it's pulling, it's pouring out of here. It's pouring out of here. I wonder if that one's just not tight enough. I bet it's um, it's not. I I don't know. I wonder if it's just not tight enough. Okay, because it looks like it's spooching out down there too, though. You know what I mean? Yeah, it is. It's spooching out down there too. Like it ain't tight enough. Like some shit's going on. So we got some shit going on. We got some shit going on. Let me get that hand wrench on there and uh, I'll tighten that stuff and I'll see what's up. Maybe they're. I I wonder. I'm, I'm thinking they're backwards. I bet they're backwards. I bet one needs swapped around. I don't know. I'll check the tightness and then uh, maybe I'll swap around and see what happens. Cause that's all I can think is it's trying. It's like rejecting it. You know what I'm saying? It's like one's going in one way, and then it's getting stuck and it can't go the other way because it's not. So one's. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, we covered an old mine. Let's get this damn radio turned off. A couple of bolts just not tightened up because I didn't get down there and tighten them up with uh by hand because I couldn't get to them. So we got to take care of man. We're going to get down here real quick, man. Damn. Wash bay right there. Wash bay. Get your hands cleaned up and stuff. You know what I mean? Because we need to. We don't want to be getting a bunch of dirty. Dirty in a damn Frankenstein. We don't need to, man. All, all of our damn arm. You know what I mean? Airwear. And uh, we don't need it. Get them cleaned up real quick. And then we'll jump back and we'll fire it up. And uh, we'll see what happens. I don't think there'll be no leaks. So I don't know. I mean. I don't know. Almost positive they're the right way. Because I remember the one. That I need. They, they crossed each other. And then the one that was in the front was in the back. And then the one that was in the back was in the front. And they crossed. And the one that was leaking. Was in the front and the back. And you just get down low in this water hole unless um you know you got the dam you got the dam uh you got the damn bucket full of water and you can just do it like that because sometimes occasionally i do that occasionally i'll have the bucket full of water that i can use we got a towel over here we got a towel over here we can dry our shit off and we had sunscreen on, but um, that all got washed off, obviously, in that situation. Because we got oil all over our shit. So it's what it is. Clean enough. Unless I got some shit on my shirt and whatnot. I don't know. Try it again. Fire it up. I mean, pressure seemed okay. That's what it usually starts off with and runs at. So I'm not worried about that, but... That's why I, I didn't also crank it down because I want that issue. But I mean, fire it up, okay? So. Sixty-five, the usual. It'll it'll come down once um, you know, it's all good. Let's see what we got. Going. Nothing. Nothing leaking up here. Like we got nothing leaking down there, so we should be good. We should be good. We should be good. Be good. We should be good. Let the same fire up, warm up a little bit. Looks all right to me. Let it build enough air to where I can move it up here. Up there. Drop it down. I'm gonna drop it down. I'm gonna drop it down. All right, crank it up some more first. I think it's okay. Cause I mean, I'm gonna crank it back up. Yeah, I could probably move it like this. 
funk, let's try it. You know what we're gonna do for the channel? I'm gonna let it build there and I'm gonna move it forward just like this with a cab up. Why not? Do it for the channel. Let's do it for the channel. All right, folks, I'm gonna try to move the truck right now with it up like that because I don't feel like jacking it down and sliding it forward and then jacking it back up. So there's enough air pressure in there right now. I'm just gonna slide it forward. I'm just gonna creep and crawl. So if I can get it into gear, then I can get it forward. I, I'm not gonna have to get too much throttle. We'll see what happens. Want me to turn it off? No, I'll just leave it running. I'm oh, not gonna talk it. Alrighty. Yeah, my freaking knees itch and stuff. So yeah, we did it. We uh we got the truck moved. It's good enough. It's still in the stones, it's in the wash bay we want it to be in, so we can uh we can wash it up now and not have to worry about it with those degrees drawn. We'll spray her down because uh I'll take the camera now. Thank you. Lovely assistant Kimberly. Where she go, mate? She goes say hi Hi. bye hi. we got so much things going on right now we cutting the grass we're doing a damn thing we're moving the trucks uh we're rolling the lawn over there filled up a pothole that was over there mower service this and that look at all this nastiness on this truck all that oil and stuff unfortunately my nice new things got covered in oil so i'll probably have to hand wash them and what's going to happen is I'm going to take my shirt off and do this because I want to get all that vitamin D everywhere I can. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to shoot that with uh, some degreaser I got. I'll tank everything and just degrease and hose it down real quick. And um, try to get this to where I get most of this oil off. So at least that's taken care of. And it's uh, moved where I can wash it. And then I will do the right thing. Um... I'll do the right thing and jack it back down when I move it back because it'll end up going back over there. And we got some stuff on the ground back here, which uh, I'll go check it out. And we got a little brush, and that's our oil spot. So we'll throw some degreaser down there too and spray her down. That way we don't um, we don't have a bunch of mess there, right there. You know what I mean in the lawn. So that's what's going on. It's moved though.